Alan, congratulations on your performance today. But you just, you're not here a long time, but how does it feel to have your first win of the season? Well, that's what we've been working on from I've been in here, so let us glad it happened today. You missed a chance earlier in the game and, and you, you, you bent over head in hand. Um, were you worried that it would come back to haunt you today if, if you hadn't won? Well, as a striker, eventually when you miss one, you feel it will haunt you in the end. The wait for the penalty was a long one. I mean, how nerving was it? That, oh, how nerve wracking was it for you? Well, it's well here, yeah, so I'm very confident for it to reach a penalty spot. All right, it's your first win of the season. Go ahead and enjoy it with your teammates. All the best going forward. Thank you. Yep, there you have it, Marlon. Player of the game. And he said there was never a doubt that he was going to score another. And as a striker, that's the attributes you want. When you miss a chance, you're up for it. It didn't miss. You did miss a lot. Well, two really good chances today come back to haunt you. I mean... It must be very disappointing in terms of that regards, but in terms of chances created in open play, probably didn't create a lot. No, no, not a lot. But I think the first, the, yeah, the second clear cut chance of the day we get it today. And, you know, unfortunately, I don't know what to say, but as I tell you earlier, before I win, I will be here, lose. So this is my last game official for Treasure Beach. I was going to go there, but you've said it. Um, that seems to have been the ultimatum. That's 12 loss, losses yeah. in a row. I mean, can't be too hard on you, the fact that... Is it that you're walking or Treasure Beach had given you the ultimatum? Well, you can, you can put it as a combination, you know. Yeah, both ways, because, you know... You know, there are certain, certain times in your life you have to make a decision, probably unpopular, you know, and things like that. Well, I think today, you know, I think somebody should really take up this. And the club share the same sentiment as me, you know, so as I said, it's a combination. It's a mutual party. Both, yeah. So that's it. Any parting words for Treasure Beach you'd want to leave with them in terms of what they probably need to do that you probably couldn't get done? No, you know, big and serious, no, <laughs> is what it is. Okay, all right then. Anything else for you in the league or it's just back to schoolboy football thinking? Oh God, that's all like me. I have a clash early in the summer. But let's see, you know. But definitely do I think I need some time to do some reflection. Honestly, you know, I, I, I don't think I gotta mess with any football until oh um the schoolboy season. I was gonna say our oh, season. So I'm gonna get my mental space back up and running, you know, and things like that and focus on the future. Well, all the best. They say you learn from these difficult moments. All the best to you. Yes, yes. Well, listen, a lot of listening, you know, a lot of listening. Because obviously, it's the biggest league in the country and you have to be in it to, to, to know about it. So, nice experience for me because it was my dream to be a coach in the Premier League and, you know, I really live it. So, it's what it is. All right, coach. All the best. Jerry, big up. So, Coach Weatherburn, they are officially stating mutual by mutual consent. They have decided to part ways themselves and, and Treasure Beach. You feel by mutual consent, um, Lime Hall is going to say to this man, stay on board. This is your first win. How does it feel? Ah, it feels good. It feels good to finally get one across the line. Uh, we've, since I've been at the club, uh, we've, we've come close. We've had some good games. We've had some games where we battled. And then there were one or two that we weren't uh, up to par. So it, it's good to, to come out and actually come out on the, on, the, on the right side of the result today. Yeah, at this stage, it's not really about performance, it's result. It wasn't the, the most silky smooth performance from you, but what is it that you like most about your team's performance today? You're right. Um, we, we normally prefer to see it a, a little bit more aesthetically pleasing, but um, it was about the result today. So we, we like the intensity, we like the desire, we, we, we really wanted to be brave. I still think we have a lot of work to do in terms of getting braver, but I, I thought today that we were we were a lot more positive. Um, we had a little bit more depth coming off the bench, uh, a few more options that we could work with, and and I felt that today we, you know we could we could have mixed it up a little bit more, and and our approach could have been a little bit different, and you know being able to play that a little bit more dynamic for us was was some of the more uh, aspects that um, you know we are pleased with the most. Well, good result by you, coach. First win, go on and, 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 and soak it in because the next assignment will be tougher. All the best. Well, you know, it's, it's, it's not about soaking this one up. I believe the work has just started. We've added to the coaching staff as well. And so for us, you know, it's important that we keep growing both on and off the pitch. All the best, Thanks. coach. Yeah.